Welcome all sins and commandments of light. This is Griever, your guys' host as always, bringing you guys the latest episode review of Wrath of the Gods. Now I have a very special treat for you guys for this episode review. I do. I have a very special treat because I have already reviewed this. We are going to go back to the future of a review that you guys have not seen. I am going to speak to myself about what I believe and thought about this episode. So take it away, Griever. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. No, that's very interesting, that's very interesting. Um, and what did you think about uh, the Merlin reveal? Ah, ah, yes, 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 I see, I see. Um, and anything to add about the whole Archangel Margaret, you know, debacle thing? Uh, what, what, what's up with that? And Vivian's death, even. Uh, do you have anything to say? Yes, yes. Well, I, I believe that my, my back to the future self, my past self reviewing from the past into the future summed it up all pretty well. So uh, thanks for watching, everyone. We'll see you back here next time. <laughs> no, no, unfortunately, ladies and gentlemen, if you can't tell, this is a very memeable joke that I'm pulling on myself. And I don't know why I'm doing it because that's more editing work. But, simple fact of the matter is, I reviewed the episode about four or five days ago, and, um, yeah. Didn't catch the audio. Not a bit of it. Not a thing. I don't know what happened. I didn't change any settings. I didn't play with anything. But, generally, I don't test my audio every single time I record. So, unfortunately, I had about a 12-13 minute review with zero audio. So, yeah. Anyways, uh, that being said, uh, we're going to go bullet point here anyways because honestly all I did was go off on a rant that was kind of spoiler-esque. Uh, more ranting about Merlin and what this entails and stuff like that. So, what can I say about this episode? Um, it was good. The animation was okay. Uh... It's hard for me to really get enthralled, honestly, in Wrath of the Gods anymore because they kind of, they did not do uh, the the hype moments justice. Like you know, of course, the bat Meliodas versus the one, the battle of the season. Uh, they did not do it justice and such. And so, and from a storytelling perspective, this would be a very good episode if you are anime only. This would be a very good episode because it breaks down a lot of stuff. We get some very good storytelling. Uh, things and in this arc in the manga, I was on the edge of my seat. I was hyped. We get the reveal the archangels are back and the archangels have taken over Margaret's body and Vivian is, is just boom dead apparently and um, all this stuff right and apparently the archangels even with a vessel can do massive hits to Zeldris unawares boom at the end of the episode. Uh, we find out all about Merlin's past with Belialin and blessed by both both gods. Actually, fun fact, when that chapter was first revealed, it was said to be the uh, the daughter of the Demon King and Supreme Deity, and it was a huge thing, but it was just a mistranslation. So, fun fact there for anime-only viewers or people who weren't caught up at that time who realized that was a big debacle. That was a big mistranslation. Something really important, right? Uh, a distinction there. So, um... But yeah, like from a storytelling perspective, it, it's fine and everything. But honestly, I'm just... <sighs> See, I was a little more lively in my last review. But I just had to review the last chapter, guys. And I know most of my viewers are manga only. So maybe... Or, or not manga only, but manga as well. So you guys can kind of understand my frustration with the series right now. The series went from a possible 9 out of 10 series for me, you know, a couple of years ago. Now down to... Uh, I'm... I. Almost every second week, I consider I, I consider dropping it twice a month. So, uh, it's just it's hard to be invested now, especially with the debacle that this season is just not doing it for me. Even though this is some really good ties, I. Uh, but since this was from a storytelling perspective for anime only viewers, I you know 
I can't be spoilery. It's so difficult. I cannot be spoilery and explain why I'm not thrilled about this episode. And I'm not thrilled about the, um, you know, the, the the revelations about Merlin and stuff. And it, it's manga stuff, guys. I, I just, I, I can't really talk about it without getting into a whole rant like I did for 12, 13 minutes. Honestly, my review was done within five minutes of that video anyways. I ranted about Merlin for about seven and a half minutes, if you want to know the truth of it. So... Uh, yeah, I mean, the, the episode was fine and stuff. I'm looking more forward to see where they're going to put the cutoff, honestly. Uh, is it going to be a 24-episode season? 26? Is it going to be more, less, more? I, I, I don't really know. I'm assuming it's going to be about 20, uh, you know, 24, 25 episodes. Um, I've got an idea where it's going to end at, uh, but I'm kind of excited to see more episodes like once again these storytelling element episodes would be big if i didn't already know you know so uh it's, i mean it was an okay episode but right now i i really i did i've been i've been trying to st not stand merlin but i've been trying to be a, a stand for merlin uh one of the only one of the only few in her corner for the longest time as a character and not as a broken plot device when Nakaba needs a game shark. But at this point, I just, I, I, you know, I tried to defend that it wasn't her fault, that, uh, you know, uh, uh, her character, it wasn't her character, it was Nakaba's writing. And just, yeah, so I, I can't get invested in a Merlin heavy episode. I mean, we finally get the reveal of where Margaret has been Margaret has been traveling with Dreyfus and and uh, Hendrickson to find Gil Thunder, who has of course been taken by Vivian. They get themselves back, but of course, ignoring the advice of Dreyfus and Hendrickson initially, Margaret offers up her body as a vessel to the Archangel Ludachel, who if we have met this season, the leader of the Archangels, who has now taken on Margaret's body as his own and is now, you know, kills Vivian get skill thunder back and be like all right i fulfilled my end of the bargain i re reunited you with your love and now let's do this and uh we jump over to see uh leonis with hauser and um gila and jericho and stuff being kind of taken over by demons and then the other two archangels appear in vessels of their own i believe one of one or both of these vessels was in the uh in the uh, the grand magic in the in the fight festival uh, that Gluxinia and Droll put on, I I think the dude with the staff. Uh, I'm not sure. Or, or earlier, they are the, the vessels we have seen previously. At least uh, the one for um, Tarmiel. Uh, but yeah, so there's three out of the four archangels right there. So uh, it is kind of hype. Don't get me wrong. The visuals weren't that bad and stuff. But uh, re-recording a video is always going to be kind of droll, anyways. And uh, yeah, honestly, right now, the way I feel about ties, I, uh, the, I, I, I'm under the firm impression that these episode reviews are going to be late from now on. This one was very late. I think the, the, the next episode, this is episode 18, I think, and episode 19 is probably already out today, if not tomorrow. So that's how late I am, honestly, even though I did record it three or four days ago. But that's beside the point. It was still late in anyways, and uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, my, my feelings and my motivation for Taizai right now are at an all-time low, ladies and gentlemen. So take that into account. Take that into account for my very dull review. I hope to be back for episode 19. I hope episode 19 is pretty good, and I hope to bring some hype with it uh, because I'm just not feeling the Taizai today. Or, honestly, this year. <laughs> 2020 is not Taizai. So, uh, but anyways, I'm going to stick with it. You know, I'm not going to drop it, so... Thanks, guys, for watching. Uh, I apologize if you're a newcomer and this is the first video you saw. Uh, unfortunately, but that's the way it is. Uh, like, comment, and subscribe if you like. Don't forget to hit the bell notification if you want to know every single time I drop a video. And if you don't want to do that, but you still want to know every single time I post a video on YouTube, you can always join the Discord where I chat there all the time with a bunch of other people about you know anime, manga, and everything in between. So... Uh, Feel free to join that. Link is in the box down below. Drink responsibly, I guess. And uh, this has been Griever. We'll see you here next time. Maybe. I don't know. See ya.